Hello everybody, this is Shamla Patasati. Today I am going to show you all how to prepare paneer butter masala. It is of a hotel style. You will have to watch this video from the beginning to the end because in between I will be giving you all some tips. Now let us see the ingredients that are required. Here I have taken 200 grams paneer and cut into the cubes. Oil as required. And here I have taken quarter teaspoon of jeera, one teaspoon of coriander powder, half a teaspoon of chili powder, half a teaspoon of salt, table salt, half a teaspoon of methi, that is kasturi methi, and here two medium size tomato, finely chopped, one medium size onion, finely chopped, and here it is a ginger, garlic, and chili, green chili, one ginger 1 inch, garlic 2 cloves, all cut finely and here fresh cream half sorry 1 teaspoon of butter. So these are the ingredients that are required. Now the tip here is if you take chili powder half a teaspoon always your coriander powder should be 1. So it goes half to 1 and tomato and onion whenever you use Tomato should be one quantity more than that of onion. So one onion and two tomatoes. So now let us start the preparation. I have kept the pan and I have added oil. That is I have put here one and a half tablespoon of oil. Once it becomes hot, we will add the jeera. Yes, I have added quarter teaspoon of jeera. Once it starts spluttering, we will add the ginger, garlic and chili which has been finely chopped. Now I will add ginger, finely chopped ginger, garlic and chili. Now this ginger should become little brown in color. Next, next finely chopped onion it should become translucent next finely chopped tomato it will get matte yes now we'll add chili powder coriander powder and quarter teaspoon of turmeric fry we will add little salt to it. Mix it. Now at this stage, we will add little water and allow it to cook till the raw smell goes away. Now at this stage, we will add 1 teaspoon of fresh cream as well as butter mix it add little more water leave it to boil we will be adding this cashew nut paste that is here I have soaked this cashew nut 7 full cashew nuts Soaked in water for half an hour and ground it into paste. Now I've added all that. Now this should boil till the raw smell goes. Let it boil for 5 to 7 minutes. Yes, now we'll add this cube cut paneer. Mix it slowly so that the paneer does not break slowly now we have used the cashew nut paste for thickening and to get a very good texture now we will at this stage will be adding kasuri methi here i have taken half a teaspoon of kasuri methi rub in your palm and then add it on 
chilies, panni, butter masala. Allow it to boil in another two minutes. It'll get ready because the panni should absorb the masalas. We'll add some more little water and allow it to boil. Yes, the kasuri methi is sorry. Paneer butter masala is ready. Here, the color is slight less here. If you want to have a red color, you can add on Kashmiri chili. Here, I've added only ordinary chili powder. Now, see the texture. We will shift on to the serving bowl. Yes, your paneer butter masala is ready. Remember, for the thing, the tips that I have given you all, for one onion, you'll be using two tomatoes. For half a teaspoon of chili powder, you'll have to use one teaspoon of coriander powder. And for the thickening, we have used the uh, cashew nut paste, which was soaked and grounded into paste. And if you want the color here, you can add on cashmere chili powder. If you like this video, like it, share it. And don't forget to subscribe. You can have this along with chapati, parota or non.